is AJ Wagener on what other. And basically, I to tell you guys everything about coronavirus. Mostly things you won't see on TV. And have you ever wondered how black students are currently coping in China? If you're interested in any of this, keep watching this video. First, what is coronavirus? Coronavirus are viruses that typically affect the respiratory tract or birds, mama, including humans. Doctors associate them with the common cold, hepatitis, pneumonia, and the SARS. Coronavirus can infect rats, mice, cats, horses, pigs, turkeys, and cows. And these animals can definitely transmit the virus to humans. China first found coronavirus in the year 1937. A coronavirus responsible for an infectious bronchitis virus in birds, which has the ability to devastate poultry stocks. Researchers first found the human coronavirus. Scientists first found evidence of human coronavirus in 1960s in the noses of people with common cold. So let's talk about the symptoms of coronavirus. We all know three common symptoms of coronavirus, which are fever, breathlessness, and cough. Apart from these three, there are other symptoms. We have fatigue, sore throat, excavated asthma, and we have runny nose. It may take 2 to 14 days for a person to notice symptoms after infection. And have you ever wondered why coronavirus is so contagious? Because it mutates effectively. Scientists cannot easily cultivate human coronavirus in the laboratory, unlike the rhinovirus, which is another cause of common cold, which makes it difficult to gauge the impact of coronavirus on national economies. And public I told you guys in the beginning about how foreign students or as I said for black students anyways if you are not a Chinese person you are a foreigner so right now how everything is in China all schools have been closed down people that stay in the dormitory are being sealed inside only the school authorities supply food into the school and the estate authority will check their temperature at the gates before they enter the estate and they try to stop visiting from friends or family from other schools to prevent spreading of this virus. Prices of food supplies have increased well not so much but the foods are now expensive. Nose masks has become very scarce to a point where they have to recycle nose masks and you don't just walk into any pharmacy store you have to stand outside by the demarcation they might leave the house once or twice in a week when necessary. It goes down, honestly. I'm going to put a clip right now for you guys to see how well this video is a market in Shenyang. Anyways, that's where I school. And Hanko is a very, very busy market. Like every single day, you can meet up to like 400 to 500 people. But just look at the street and see how empty the, sh the restaurants, the shops, the malls, everything is just empty just because of this coronavirus. I'm sure you guys are also wondering if school is ever going to start. Anyways, they found an alternative. Right now, they've started online classes for students in China. And if you are back home, planning to go back, you can't right now because of the virus, obviously. Ever since this virus has been spreading, there have been different videos on the internet. You see something like this. Can you just imagine can you just imagine that? Like, just take a moment to imagine that video. That's, I, I'm, I don't even know what to say about it. Just tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. Anyways, there are also videos of people in China already spreading the disease because, I don't know, because they don't want to die alone or something. They've been spitting on elevators, spitting everywhere just to pass the virus to and some people have told me this personally that Chinese people did that because they are wicked people. I don't think they are wicked. It's just the fear of death that's kind of the problem here. That can happen in any country. It can happen even in Nigeria currently. The moment you know, like for example, this is not part of the video, but you know people that has HIV AIDS that don't tell their partner they have HIV AIDS because they want them to also be affected. So don't go around telling people that Chinese people are wicked or they are heartless or whatever. 
it's cause they're just scared of death. It's wrong, it's really really wrong, but they are doing it. So just take a look at the sleep. Just take a look at the sleep. Boating is just taking a turn on everybody like mentally physically emotionally sp even spiritually because like everybody's just praying even our parents back home your gear is going to jack back soon so i'm going to peace out soon very soon like for real because i'm not doing no i'm doing nothing here and it's kind of like deranging and all that like you're just sleeping eating waking up movie if you have like for people that have other things to do like it's something else and so yeah that's how every single person in china is feeling right now transmission of coronavirus coughing and sneezing without covering the mouth can disperse droplets into the air touching or shaking hands with a person who has the virus can pass the virus between individuals making contact with a surface or object that has the virus then touching nose, eyes or your mouth with it. If symptoms are active, please stay at home and rest. Also avoid close contact with other covering your mouth and nose with a tissue or handkerchief while sneezing or coughing and make sure you dispose of those after use. SARS is a virus responsible for severe acute respiratory syndrome. During November 2002, the virus started in Guangdong province in southern China, eventually reaching Hong Kong. It rapidly spread around the country, causing infection in more than 24 countries. The mortality rate was 9.6%, and authority eventually controlled SARS in July 2002.